Hey, what's up guys, Rami is here. A quick video about image control box of Frontier 570 by Fujifilm. So this is a, actually this is a small computer, small PC inside a, inside a printer and that receives your images, your pictures from you from the computer and converts this to an analog signal and prints in, in you know, by laser. So actually this is a printer itself here and this box this image control box located here underneath, you know, you open the door underneath the black, you know, wall or some kind of st this stuff. And you see and I'm screwing that black thing. So uh, three screws here and screws on either side. Just pull the door off and it will in. So as you see, much, much stuff. It's going on here. I have shown. So, first of all, this is you know some kind of power supply, but this is not the power supply. Frontier Five Seventy has its own uh, own power supply. It's uh, plus and minus 12, 12 volt rail, and some DC, DC converters we have here that convert some this. To 12 volts into 5 volt we see here and we see let me turn this off so as you see here we have 5 volt here we have 3.3 .3 volt here so this is your some kind of DC to DC converter so 12 volt and minus and plus 12 volt let's let me show you just in a second. So as you see here, only plus and minus 12 volt rail. This is ATX1, the same as, as here. So power comes in to this stuff. Uh, I think this fan this fan it's working on 24 volts maybe plus and minus 12 volts it's going to 24 volts going here should be i think if i'm not wrong so should, should go. so secondly you have sd ram this is old school pc 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 133 one should be uh, 512, 512 megabytes and a half gigabytes. This is a half gigabyte SD RAM made by Samsung, I think. Should be Samsung. Yeah, here you go. Samsung. Made by Samsung. So this is a pretty, you know expensive and hard to find part so another board here we have is your digital to image digital to analog converter let me take this off carefully there you go your digital to another converter. You have some uh, crazy stuff going on actually, but it's not. So let me just show you in a second. So your pictures from the computer, so called. Uh, FMPC, Frontier Manager, Printing Controller, I think should be a computer that connects directly to the printer, uh, Frontier 570, and that sends your images as ones and zeros, so as a digital, to them, to, through your, let me have it, show you, through this, this guy, this port here, 1394 port. It comes here into main board. 
this board here, 1394, the main board, and then to, to this board, digital to analog converter. So it's being converted from your digital signal as your respective to your uh, three three colors, RGBs, R stands for red, G stands for green, B stands for blue, as you know. Three channels, it goes here. And being converted to analog signal, as you see, I was saying, respective to your colors. And you have here your output. Your output, RGB, should be maybe RGB or RGB. Let me have a look. So, okay, so this one is R, this one is G, G this one is B. R, G, B, B. So, uh, so the coaxial cable, it goes to directly to LDD board on front of 570 and to AOM driver, AOM crystal, laser, and it's printed on a print, on a paper, laser paper, and you have your prints out. So here's your digital to analog, con uh, the analog converter. Very expensive board. Another board we have here is this guy here. It's a, your timer board. As you see, your your battery, three volt battery. It's a three volt battery. You can sometimes it goes wrong. You can you have to you have to replace that if you are going to replace that you can replace for any any other three volt battery but uh, please make sure that you know what you are doing you know polarity plus and minus and if you are doing you are doing that at own at your own risk that please please make sure that you know what you are doing so this is your timer board it's you know if, for example if, if you have put this machine uh, for to wake up at eight o'clock every morning. Uh, that sends a signal and wakes uh, uh, machine wakes up or uh, turns on, heats up, everything is ready when you are when you are come opens the, you know your laboratory at nine o'clock or nine nine thirty, it's ready for, to print. So this is you know very expensive board as well. So another board, the last board here, it's your. 1394 port uh, board that receives uh, receives your images from computer through, through this cable. Let me show you the cable here. Just a minute. Here is a cable. This cable goes into here. As you see, this way, and this this comes from FMPC or scanner, and then transmits your images to this board. And this board, uh, after this board, it goes to, through motherboard, as I said, and then to digital, to digital to analog converter. So the part number of the actual motherboard is. Its name is GMC23. I, I don't know what does G stands for. Maybe, maybe general, maybe. But MC is a main controller. Uh, GMC main controller board. So its part number, as you see, and Fujifilm part number begins from 11. You see here, let me show you. This is your. This is your part number if you want to order one. 113C105-9571. This is your part number for Fujifilm. It's named GMC3. GMC23. Sorry. So you have created some micro microprocessors. Yeah, it's your micro CPU, microprocessor here. Some kind of, you know, should be pro. Looks like. Because it's, you know, it's its own. own software uh, you can press the button and load the entire machine without any computer you can't print that but you can you know do basic printing uh, basic stuff you know you can test test pattern print uh, print out and you know check some basic you know functions 
uh, the standalone. So this is a processor, a microprocessor, micro and you, you, oh, should be from your own board, I think. So that's all that we have here. Um, this fan, it usually goes wrong. Actually, not this fan itself, but uh, some kind of sen sensor it has inside that, you know, uh, says, talks to motherboard and says him that it's turning. When the sensor goes wrong, motherboard thinks that it's not working and gives an error, image box, image, image box fan error, fan failed, image, image box fan mm, bad, or bad image box uh, fan, I can't remember the exact, in, exact message, but uh, you get the point that is some, this is a you know, typical issue with these boards. Please keep this, this board uh, clean, dust free, you know, and make sure that it's cooling down and you, you will make this happy and it will work for you with great pleasure. So, actually, electronics doesn't like hot, getting hot. So, it's in general. This is a quick video that I want to, I would like to share with you. Maybe some, someone has no interest in this. Have a good one. Bye. See you later.